Josh, Daily Mail now. BBC Radio 2, it seems, are hemorrhaging listeners due to their policy of ageism, hiring 50-year-old scamps like Scott Mills to yeah, replace 89-year-old <laughs> presenters. So Radio 2 refugees have abandoned the BBC station for commercial alternatives. Yeah. Actually, all of the BBC uh, output seems to have gone down. The radio output has gone down considerably uh, and is moving over. And they've lost, yeah, um, 500... 580,000 uh, listeners during the year. And they've lost Ken Bruce, Steve Wright, Paul O'Grady. Um, and that's... Lost or sacked? Well, some of them sacked. Yeah. Some of them kind of not shown the love. OK. And so... Uh, but definitely with an agenda to chase for the youth audience. Yeah. And this is the thing is that, first of all, th those 580,000 people were from last year. So the impact, what's going to be happening now is going to be bigger than that. Yeah. And number two is you never chase your audience. Like, don't chase youth. Let mm. your youth get old. Yeah. And that's the problem. But to be right fair, now. it's going to happen every so often at Radio 2. I think Paul O'Grady went a little bit early, possibly, but I do think possibly Steve Wright had run his course. I mean, he'd had an extraordinarily long career in the, in the very 21 centre. years, I think, and now yeah, 31. massive. So this guy, Scott Mills, who I don't listen to, he's been on Radio 1, but he's been very popular there. He is now 50 years old. That's surely old enough to be able to be trusted with Radio 2, isn't it? There'll be a little bit of a bump, and then... Well, are, we not, are we not failing to recognise that this... Is, I mean, I do understand Radio 2 is for the mature listener. They like to hear classic pop from the 60s and 70s, but it's not like they're bringing in gobby 16-year-olds or something to do... Well, something. Paul O'Grady left because he had to work with Rob Beckett. I didn't think uh -huh. Rob was that bad. I've met him. He seems all right. But, um, Rob's 37. Well, yeah, what I love is this boom radio, though, Simon, where you have to be born between 1946 and... 1964, I've checked your birthday, you just miss out. Oh, but, um, I miss that. I miss yeah, Genetics, it's pretty cool. It's, it's, for boomers, it's called Boom Radio. But the great thing about this is it's all just great for GB because the more people mm. that stop listening to Radio 2... Increasing radio station. Yeah, thank you very much. Oh, Wonderful. Yeah. We do need some more music on the channel.